Welcome to Two Cross Farms. I'm Kim. Along with my son, my husband, Jean, and my daughter-in-law, Rachel, we raise chickens. Also, our granddaughters help out. Today, we want to introduce you to one of our favorite chickens, Golf Ball. Now, she got that name a couple years ago because she likes to sit on golf balls. Now, we use that as a tool to encourage them to um, nest and to, rate and to hatch eggs. So, once she's sitting on, on eggs, we go ahead and pull all the golf balls out, we put the eggs under her and we mark them, and then three weeks later we have all our baby chicks. Well, first I want to introduce you to Golf Ball. Yes, she is. Yes, she is. And she's not really going to be so happy. Yes, she is. Okay, this is Golf Ball. And Emma's going to show you the eggs we have sitting under her. We can't keep her off too long because she likes to keep them nice and warm. Okay, on day three, my husband called me out and said, Hey, Kim, you better come out here and check this egg out. So, I come out, and this is what we find. Now, it's clearly one of the eggs that I've marked. It's got the X's on it. And at first, I'm thinking Dean's probably trying to play a trick on me. But under more close examination, you can see there's no way he could have put this golf ball inside the shell without it cracking and destroying it. So, I contacted our folks at Purdue University Agricultural Department. They put me in touch with their egg specialist, or the chicken specialist, who confirmed that, of course, golf ball couldn't have eaten the golf ball. But what they suspect happened is that she sat on the golf balls, she absorbed it up through her vent, she formed a shell around it, and then she laid it. So, we have our very first free-range organic golf ball. Well, thanks for checking, folks. See you later. Bye.